welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Brie sorry it's been so long that's a whole nother story but we'll just go ahead and get into today's video which is going to be an unboxing review initial thoughts whatever on the Yaki 30 wig this isn't the first time that I purchased this wig I got it like two years ago two or two or three years ago and I really liked it, so I wanted to see if I still like it. This All right, so the hair comes in this box. And they do have several different styles. This is actually the only style that I've tried. It is, they have the French wave, Yaki 30, body wave, bohemian, loose, deep, straight, and curly. I do want to try that straight wave because I've seen it before. And I feel like it'll be really nice. But... So then you get the wig and it looks like this. And it lets you know like on the back how you're able to shift the wig to make the parting. I'm gonna be doing this as a middle part more than likely. And there's the box. Okay, so this way that I have on came with this thing. I guess that's new. I've never seen that, but I also don't be wearing synthetic wigs like that to know. Um, and so far, this is the wig. It's actually not shiny at all. But I mean, it is shiny, but it's very soft. I feel like you would definitely have to straighten this for the look that I'm going for, but you don't have to straighten it. This part is disgusting. Not disgusting, but I mean, <laughs> It's gonna need some work. Like, do not take this wig straight out the pack and put it on your head. It you will look crazy. Um. So yeah. So like I was saying, it comes with this sponge thing, and then it also has a comb in the back, adjustable straps, and two combs in the front that go right here. That's weird. I would never use that. I need to stop talking shit about where they put these combs because it's none of my business. Just put the wig on my head. But if you're into using combs, please let me know what you actually use them for. But yeah, I'll be right back with this wig on. So this is the hair right out of the pack. And let me just say right now, I look crazy. It's 2020. A lot of y'all stop here. Like, get the wig, you put it on, and that's it. Let's not carry that over into this new year because this is ridiculous. Like I look like somebody off the Adams family. I don't remember the name, but it's not okay. <laughs> but the hair is very soft. And I will, it's very, very long. It says it's supposed to be 30 inches. To me, it probably is because I'm very short, but this is where the hair is on me. I'll also stand up. Hopefully, you guys can see. But yeah. So, one thing that I can say is I'm probably not, depending on how I like it. I do have a mirror right here. I'm trying to make sure I don't look super crazy. Like, people screenshot shit nowadays. But, um, this fucking is going to get on my nerves. But I don't think I'm going to cut it i may cut it when it starts to get nappy at the ends but i don't think i'm gonna cut this this time around i am gonna make better layers on my face and probably try to thin this out but aside from that i'm not gonna do much to this wig and then i'm also gonna straighten it too but um this this cap is extra stretchy i did put on the adjustable straps and i still have a whole bunch of room so i'm gonna go and cut off the lace adjust it to how i like plug the part and then i'll come back to let you guys know what the final look is all right so this is the wig i did get a chance to pluck the part and i do think it's super pretty um 
I did straighten the hair as well and I did cut it some more it was like I showed you guys how long it was but it was still way too long for me I probably am gonna cut it a little bit more so that way I can wear it every single day because I know at the length that this is it will tangle it hasn't yet the shedding I feel like only came from me plucking the part which didn't take me too long I did actually get a hole in the part so I would say be very 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 careful when you are plucking it because it's not like the human frontals you can't like undo the knot and pull it out like I feel like when I undid the knot and pulled it out the whole circle just grew rather than just removing the knot so be very careful about that but overall my first thoughts about this hair is that it is giving bundle vibes like yes <laughs> i like it this wig did cost me about 20 25 dollars so not too expensive i feel like it does everything it needs to do for the price that it is i did purchase this hair before in the beauty supply store and it was like 50 dollars. so i promise you if you guys can wait a couple of days just order the shit online because you're gonna save so much money beauty supply stores are literally doubling the price of these 20 dollars wigs just to make a profit for convenience but yeah i do like this hair and i do give it let's see oh i give it as far as right now i'll give it a 9 out of 10 i can't say 10 out of 10 only because i don't really like like i like the parting but it's so skinny also i don't know how fast this hair is going to tangle i do plan on taking it off every single night so we will see let's go ahead and like comment and subscribe and thank you so much for watching